so we have another android 15 base custom room is here android 15 base custom rooms are now coming and yes with a lot of customizations they will be here very very soon but here we have project blaze the version is 4.0 based on android 15 as expectedly things are quite stock here i mean no customizations at all it was expected and we might get some customizations very soon for now this is literally a stock variant but still it's not bad we'll talk about some of the things in this video stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end this is under 15 based project blaze let me show you some of the things here firstly if you're able to notice here the settings ui is redesigned it's looking like art style ui Typical project blaze if you have used this custom room with android 14 you already got to know that and we have this option available called blaze house this sub menu available there where you will get all the customizations for now it's empty as expectedly but yes we will get some customizations and features very very soon maybe with the next update which is also coming soon with october security patch because it's just few days left some of the great features of Android 15, those are present here, like this predictive back animation. It's by default enabled now. In Android 14 or earlier versions, I guess, you get these things options available in developer settings. But in Android 15, these things are available by default and it's enabled in this custom room too, which is good. We also have the new color contrast option present in Android 15 now, and it is also available in this custom room. You can adjust the colors on the, on the display, and I'm not exactly sure how many of you actually use this feature on your devices. One thing in case you don't know, whenever you open the screen timeout, and if you want to increase the screen timeout, you have to put your fingerprint or basically your screen lock to enable this thing to change the screen timeout and it's just not only with the screen timeout this is also available in the lock screen timeout this option is also available with whenever you have enabled usb debugging for example if you change it to file transfer or only to usb tethering or if you want to change the switch modes and then you have to enable your fingerprint sensor you have to put your fingerprint at least once there which is quite amazing quite not expected actually this notification read reply and control this is the new text i found basically this option was not like that it's just renamed to notification read reply and control also one more thing moving on to security and privacy options one of the major highlights in android 15 based custom room is a new private space option in case you don't know by default now android 15 brings you this private space feature which is in, in some other OEMs, for example, MIUI, HyperOS, One UI, Realme UI, even OnePlus, anywhere, most of the times or in most of the operating systems right now, have second space or clone apps feature. But right now, after a long time in stock Android with Android 15, now you finally have the private space, which is similar to the second space in HyperOS, I guess, which is similar to the clone apps or similar feature like that. But personally speaking, the getting this feature in the stock Android is a great thing because by default, it was not available from past few versions. So that's a very useful thing. Personally speaking, this is one of my favorite feature. Private space is here. You can set it up on your device and at the bottom of the pixel launcher, you'll find this thing. One thing, let me tell you that this is available with the pixel launcher. Yes, in case you change the launcher, private space apps will not be in the private space section anymore. But for this one, we have a launcher support that is Niagara launcher. In case you are using Android 15, you want to change the launcher. You can do so and you can try out Niagara launcher because Niagara launcher supports the Android 15's private space that is so amazing private space also has some extra changes options available for you for example if i unlock this thing you'll see this settings button here you have these options available for you you can adjust these things according to your own preference but if you click on hide private space what this is if i enable this feature if i lock this thing it's gone from here the private space is not available how to find it you can search for it and then you will be able to find this thing this is actually quite useful in many cases actually it's available there it's available in the settings you can adjust a lot of things private space is actually a great addition with android 15 and the good thing is it will be available by default in most of the custom rooms for example i guess with lineage is not so sure but with some of the stock based custom rooms you'll get this thing one more thing is some wallpaper and style UI changes are there. Whenever you open to, whenever you open any wallpaper, want to change this thing, 
you want to apply any other wallpaper like for example this is the one if i click on ok click on these kind of options set wallpaper you can see this new preview ui it is not like that in android 14 if you are already using i guess most of you are actually using android 14 so yes these are the things available these were things i just wanted to let you know another android 15 based custom room is out and also including this one we have some more android 15 based custom rooms coming if you want to know more some changes or feature which are coming make sure to subscribe this channel also make sure to like this video thanks for watching